Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Before you connect your Odoo with the Seller Central account, you first need to register your seller ID with Amipro's IAP account. Basically, this IAP account is linked with order reference number of your purchase of this application from Odoo App Store. Now let us register a new seller in your Odoo. So here I am on my Odoo database wherein I have already installed Amazon application. I'll click on Amazon application. I'll go to the configuration settings where I find an option to register your seller ID which will take me to one registration form wherein I need to fill up this information name, email ID which is associated with your seller central account. One verification mail will be sent to this email ID. So enter this email ID carefully. This is the order reference number of your Odoo App Store. This is the merchant ID. This is the marketplace. And here you need to enter the security code. Now let us see from where I can get this merchant ID from my Amazon Seller Central account. So here I am on my Amazon Seller Central account. Wherein I will go to settings, account information. There I see an option called merchant token which will open up the information of my merchant ID over here. I need to take this information, go back to the registration form and enter it over here. Now here I can select marketplaces. Now there can be possibilities that under single merchant ID there will be a multiple marketplace associated. You need to select the main marketplace that was initially used for this merchant ID. There can be also possibilities that a seller holds multiple merchant ID for each of the region like for US, for Europe, they hold different merchant IDs. So this process is to be followed multiple times for all of your merchant IDs. But for each of the merchant ID, this process is to be done once. Like if you have already registered your seller for uh, your staging database, then you don't need to repeat this process when you are using it in your production. Now once I have added this information, I need to click this checkbox. But before you do this, make sure that you read all the terms and conditions carefully. Add the security code given below and click on the register button. Now as I click on this register button, I will get one verification email that I have added over there in that form. There I find an option to verify this email ID. As I click on this button, my registration will be completed. So this was the seller registration process. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you.